In this video, I'm going to use the Shapiro wave test to test for normality given this sample here, which is uh, poor for observations. So, for us to use the Shapiro wave test, you first need to go to the MATLAB file exchange. So, I can just go to that page. So, on the MATLAB file exchange, you look for the Shapiro wave test for normality. I've included the link to this page in the video description below. So what you need to do is you need to go on and download this file and then after downloading it and then you put it in the current working folder. And then when you are done you can then go on and use the Shapiro wave test. So I will now go back to my MATLAB. So here in code I'll click on the return key and then use the Shapiro wave test. So the result that we want there is an H is equals to then go on the Shapiro test is SW test. This one now, which is appearing here. Then open parenthesis. Then we put our sample here, the X. We can specify the alpha here if you want to, the level of significance. But by default, if you do not specify the level of significance, then by default it's set to be 0.05. So what I can do, I can go on and run. And we're having the edge is saying logical zero. When it's saying zero there, it means that we do not reject the null hypothesis at the level of significance, which we are saying by default is 0.05. When doing the normality test, the null hypothesis is that the data is normally distributed. The alternative hypothesis is the data is not normally distributed. So in this case it's giving us H logical zero, which means that we do not reject the null hypothesis. And when we do not reject the null hypothesis, we conclude that there is not enough evidence to suggest that the data is not normally distributed. So if you need other information besides this H equals to zero, we can edit this command so that uh, we have uh, the H, then the P value, and uh, the Shapiro wave test. So I can just edit this command here to change that so I can open brackets, then the H, which will give us a 0 or a 1, then uh, space, then we put the P value, then space, then uh, the Shapiro wave test statistic. And then close the bracket. Then I go on and run. So it's giving us our H here. As before, the result is giving us a zero. So we do not reject the null hypothesis. And a p value, if you need it, it gives us the 0 0.0946. In this case, the p value is not less than 0 0.05. So we make the same decision again that we cannot reject the null hypothesis. And uh, the Shapiro wave statistic is 0 0.8826. So in this case, we are concluding that there is not enough evidence to suggest that the data is not normally distributed.